Cities across Indonesia honored Raden Ayu Kartini on Monday in celebrations marking the achievements of the women's rights pioneer. It was a day of roses, comedy and even a transgender football match. Women in Kertapazuki village, located in Brebes district, central Java, took part in a blindfolded makeup competition to observe the holiday. Participants covered their eyes and applied makeup to the models. The competition provided entertainment and comedy for the entire village since the models made up by the blindfolded contestants looked noticeably worse at the conclusion of the event. The village also held a fashion show with local women hitting the catwalk in traditional dresses. Female police personnel in Bogor, West Java, held a friendly rally to remind road users of traffic laws. Although they performed routine road checks, no tickets were issued. Instead, the officers only reminded violators of traffic regulations and handed out roses. In Bandung, West Java, female members of the traffic administration, Samsat, wore traditional Javanese kabayas while on duty to mark the holiday. The wearing of traditional attire by female Samsat personnel is a tradition that is held annually to celebrate Kartini Day. In Indramayu, West Java, Kartini Day was commemorated by the city's transgender citizens. Members of the Pantora Transgender Sisterhood organized a football match with players from the district of Indramayu, Kuninghan and Chirabon all participating. The football tournament was held not only to mark Kartini Day, but also to remind Indonesian women to fight for their rights and demand respect in society.